It is with Mike Rengua, Northwest Fight Scene, the new fight scene.com. Backstage you're with uh, Joey Elzia, or is it LZ? Elzia. Elzia uh, is, is officially, but everyone has called me Elzia, Eliza, Elzia, so I never correct anyone anymore. I just say, yep, you got it. All right. <laughs> so here at Tacoma Dome, uh, you just retained your dominant FC Bantamweight title with the uh, unanimous decision over Brandon Monteith, but you gave him the belt, man. I've never, ever seen that in 12 years of covering the sport. Uh, talk about that moment. Uh, you know, I just, uh, I don't know, you're in the fight and you're in the moment, and uh, I was trying to stay busy. I got taken down in most of the rounds. I don't remember, because uh, it all blends in in five rounds. I was trying to stay busy off my back, working for submissions and everything, but I wasn't able to for sure get any submissions in, and I was on my back a lot of the fight. So at the end of it, I mean, I have to watch the fight again to really judge it, but I felt like I lost the fight. So even though they announced me the winner, I gave him the belt, because I just felt like he, you know, he earned it in the moment at least. Right yeah. now, uh, obviously you're going, you're going for a lot of submissions during the fight. Uh, looked like a couple times you had him real close. Talk yeah. about uh, those times. Those uh, you know, it was just small adjustments. I went for uh, a couple of heel hooks and it was kind of close, but my position was just a little off. And then in the third round, I had a really deep arm bar and he yelled out and I thought he yelled out tap. And so I sort of let go a little bit when he yelled out and then he, and he was able to pull it out. So that's why I, if you see me in the third round, I was like, he tapped, he tapped, kind of yelling at the judge, but you know, whatever, man, you just got to keep going. If, if it doesn't get called off or if it, until the ref steps in, you know, you don't, shouldn't have let it, shouldn't right. have let it go. Right. Well, uh, officially 6-0. Uh, it, this win, uh, you came off a win and it went to Hawaii just recently. Mm -hmm. uh, that, it sounds like a good experience. How'd that go? Uh, it was pretty cool, man. It was a, it was a good fight, real close, really uh, dangerous kickboxer. And uh, uh, luckily, I came out with the with the decision in that one as well. So it was good. It was a good fight. Interesting experience, but <laughs> that's a that's a whole other story. Right. Right. Yeah. Okay. Uh, anyone to thank for tonight? Um, you know, my gym, uh, Charlie's Combat Club. Uh, everyone who came out to the fights, you know, without without people to watch the fights, we uh, would just be fighting in alleyways or something. <laughs> yeah, uh, my sponsor is Granger Painting, and um, uh, my opponent, man, he, he came and, and he, fought, he fought a good fight. All right. Well, you heard it here tonight. Joey Elzia, uh, still the Bantamweight, 135-pound champion without the belt. All right. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you.